Thank mm-hmm. you.
Thank you. 
Welcome to my uh, guitar tutorial. This is going to be uh, part of a uh, seven-part series. Uh, this is something I've been working on for quite a while. I'm calling this uh, 84 combinations, four bars per mode, 12 major scales, 12 major keys, seven modes, cage scale system, guitar tutorial, part one. Okay, so um, I guess I'll start off by just maybe talk a little bit about how I came up with this. This was a, a practicing strategy I came up with um, probably uh, in the summer of last year, I started get putting this together. And I've uh, uh, talked about bits and pieces of this and did some videos uh, doing everything in one key. So uh, th this is a, a, a strategy where I'm doing um, all uh, 84 different um, modes, you know, seven modes times 12. So, um, so that's so. So, what I'll have here for you, uh, I'll go through all the different resources that'll that'll be below, uh, linked below the video. So, uh, I'll just kind of go in order. So, the I'll have the iReal Pro format. So, if you have iReal Pro, you can you know download that on your uh, on your uh, iPad or uh, iPhone, or you can copy the HTML and put it on your computer. Uh, so, I'll have that. Um, right now, I'm doing. Uh, I like I like practicing at slow tempos. This is jazz ballad at a metronome 58. I just like that slow um, approach. There'll also be a PDF of the chord chart that you can follow along. So with the chord chart, what I did is I took the liberties of putting in um, 
like what the mode is and what the parent key is. So for example, the very first chords are D minor seven to E major seven. So that's like D Phrygian in the key of B flat. The next one is a, 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 is a B minor to an E minor. I'm calling that B Aeolian from the key of D. Okay, so that's so so that that'll help you when you're doing your uh, your improvising uh, with these um, devices. Okay, so the next thing I have is a PDF of of 84 combinations, seven modes, 12 uh, major keys, and I'm gonna have these little note cards. Let me pull out one of those. So I have these kind of note cards, and this is how I came up with these. These are all just random. So, so all the different studies I'll be doing is all just random. So so I would just you know, take these cards and just pull them out. So C Phrygian. So C Phrygian is from the key of um, key of A flat, and then do, and then just so the idea here is, is was to become as familiar as I could with all the different major scales and modes, with the understanding that if I had a a, a tune that had a, a you know different. Um, you know, basic chords, you know, two, five, ones, or, uh, you know, minor seven flat five chords, I can, you know, easily start to at least pull out some basic uh, scale patterns. Okay, so the no cards, so you can use those, you can, you know, make up your own progressions, you know, so like, I'll just pull out another one randomly. So let's say you got, I got the C Phrygian again. Okay, so let's go, let's do another one here. And I gotta keep on pulling out the same one. Okay, so G flat Dorian or, or or F sharp F sharp Dorian. That's key of E. So you can just do a vamp in F sharp Dorian, or you can you know think of these as uh, power chords, or you can use these to just kind of make up random progressions. Just you know you know make no cards you know to make no cards for yourself and stick them in a hat and then uh, you know, pull them out. So I so I have that uh, 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 PDF of that. So then I have a PD uh, two different PDFs of the five cage scale positions in the key of C. So the idea here is that you look at as you learn them in the key of C, and then you move them you move them around. So for example, uh, let's say the Phrygian. Okay, so Phrygian in the key of uh, key of C is here E F E F G A B C D E F G A B C D E F G. Okay, so then the very first one is a D Phrygian, so B, key B flat. So I just come to here, D, and then just play the same pattern. I'm not going to do the note names. Is there another? Oh, yeah, okay, E Phrygian. And then there's a C sharp Phrygian. So C sharp Phrygian would be from the key of A, so same pattern. Okay, and so on. Um, okay, then Aeolian. So, so, so Aeolian uh, in the key of C would be f starting from A. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C. So uh, I have. Uh, Two versions of that. I have a, a sheet that has all five positions uh, on one sheet, and then I also have individual diagrams. So each of those positions is is a big diagram on, on one of the pages uh, of the PDF. So let's say I wanted. Okay, so that was a. So let's say uh, I wanted to do um, so B Aeolian. So B Aeolian is from the key of of D. So I just come to here and play the same pattern. Okay, and then I think there's one more here that we did. Uh, yeah, D Aeolian from the key of F. And then just pull out all your different uh, you know, scales, uh, arpeggios, and whatever. Um, okay, and then, and, uh, so, that's, so that's that. So, so then you, just, you would just have to just take each of those you know, five patterns that I've shown you and then just move them you know, to whatever, whatever key is in these uh, random progressions or you can make up your own progressions. And then the last thing would be the modal pentatonic. So I just include a modal, uh, uh, a pattern, uh, modal pentatonic. So let's see, I, I, just, I, I guess I did the D one. So D modal, modal pentatonic would be uh, C, D, F, G, A, C, D, F, G, A, C, D, F, G, A. That would be one of them. Uh, then uh, let's see what, what's another interesting one. Okay, so then for the for the A flat, that's going to be A flat major uh, pentatonic. So if I went to to C, B C E F G, B C E F G, B C E F G. So that's modal pentatonic for the for the major. And then um, let's see what there, there was a Lyd yeah it was a Lydian one. I did I think I did D Lydian. So if you're um, Let's see if you're if you're in the key of C, then your Lydian would be based off of F. So E F 
A, B, C, E, F, A, B, C, E, F, A, B, C. Okay, so that's, so, so, so you can take the, the key of C uh, diagrams that I have here, and then you can move them around to the different keys. So once again, the idea here was I wanted to come up with, um, I wanted to come up with the strategy for myself of practicing, um, and then do the different, um, uh, you know, different scales. So then, in the opening progression, uh, opening section, I did uh, just you know just the basic scales going across. And you might have noticed I switched picks each time, just to give me a little different sound. So, for example, for the second one, I just did. Um, I'll go ahead. And... So this is just a uh, B Aeolian. <laughs> Okay, I'll just do that a little bit. So B Aeolian, just going across the scale. So then, what I'm doing is, then as the chords are coming by, I'm just trying to emphasize the chord tone. So like here, so you got to do B minor. So that was a, one strategy. I'll, let me pick out one more. Let's do, um, uh, let's do maybe um, like uh, G Ionian. Okay. So so I so, so when you look at the the five diagrams, you'll see that Ionian. Okay, so if you're in the key of C, uh, Ionian and uh, Locrian are going to are going to be the same pattern. The Dorian will be by itself. The uh, Phrygian and Lydian will be together, and then the Mixolydian will be its own pattern, and then uh, back to Aeolian. So let's let's do a key. So I'm doing key of G. So this is this is this pattern here. I'll just kind of play through that a little bit. So so that's the idea. Just kind of get yourself familiar with the the patterns, and then as you get more into this, you can do like the like like the, the one octave patterns, the arpeggios, pedal tones, and so on. Okay, this is just a G scale. How about like uh, arpeggio? See, I'm leading, there I was leading into the guy tones. So you, you get the idea of that. So just kind of to become familiar with the parent scale. Okay, so then the other thing I did is going to take a little bit more uh, work on your part to figure out how to do this. So so if you look at the second one, B Aeolian, so the one octave scales. So you have B, C sharp, D, E, F sharp, G, A, B. So that's part of Aeolian. Then what I did is I moved it up to here. B, C sharp, D, E, F sharp, G, A, B. That's going to take a little bit more kind of thought and, and practice for you to, to figure those out. Uh, but you can use all the cage patterns to, to, to find all these things. Uh, let's say the next one, E Phrygian. So E Phrygian, a one octave scale, E, F, G, A, B, C, D, E. And then the one here, E, F, G, A, B, C, D, E. All right, so all these one, the one octave scales are all within the cage positions. You just, you just have to figure out where they are by taking those, the, the C ones and, and moving them around. Okay, then seventh chord arpeggios. Um, that's just you know, you know, you're taking your your uh, uh, scale and and, and uh, putting it in third. So let's say I went to. Um, Where's a good a good one here? So how about that? I go to this B Locrian. So so one octave scale B D F A is a B B minor seven flat five chord B D F A. Okay, and then I think what I did here, rather than coming up to here, I think I went here. So B D F A B. Okay, there's a, so there's a lot there. Okay, and then for some of the ones where there was two chords. Like let's say I said C sharp minor to D major seventh, so that's the key of uh, of A. So C sharp E, G sharp B, 
and then D major 7, D, F sharp, A, C sharp. So I just kind of went back and forth between those two, and then I went here, C sharp, E, G sharp, B, D, F sharp, A, C sharp. So you can see it's going to take a little bit of study to really get these. And then the ones that have just uh, triads, then I just decided to do that. So like, for example, the D minor to G. I went D, F, A, G, B flat, D, and then sometimes I went backwards. Uh, and then I did like half step slides. So for the D and then for the G. Okay, and then the one starting from root four, D, F, A, and then G, B flat, D. Okay, and then backwards I did, I think I did a half step slide into the A, and then for the D, uh, for the G. All right, so just a couple, a couple quick devices there. Okay, so then for the pedal tones, so that's just something that I saw Jimmy Bruno do uh, many years ago. I thought that you know he 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 does a little different thing. I think he does like a high pedal tone, but it's still the same, uh, the same idea. So let's say I was on, uh, let's say I'm on this B minor here. So so I'm I'm just uh, so I'm just going back to that low B. I was just kind of randomly skipping around. Uh, I didn't do this in the in the video, but I I was also uh, conceptualizing something where it would go kind of really fast. I think that's kind of how Jimmy Bruno does it. Okay, I'll do the same thing here: B, C sharp, D, E, F sharp. E. And there's any kind of rhythms you get. Here I'm doing two and one. Boom. I'm just yeah. Or, blah, blah, blah. or I can just do one, one. Okay, or I can do, do like what I call tremolo picking. And, and so on. Uh, let's see, I'll do one more. How about um, how about the G Ionian ones? So G. So there, instead of playing the A there, sometimes I play the, uh, the the second note of the scale on the adjacent string. Kind of makes a nice nice melody. Right, you can make some nice nice riffs there. And then from G here. tremolo and so on okay that's the tremolo picking okay and then with the with the pedal tones okay and i'll talk a little bit about the the modal pentatonics so what i decided to do there i just decided to add some delay because it's you know we're playing some pen, pentatonic ideas so you can look at that sheet with the modal pentatonics so some of the modal pentatonics for the minor uh, the minor chords will look very familiar. C, D, F, G, A, C, D, F, G, A for the D minor, C, D, F, G, A. And what, as I've stated in a lot of my videos, you can throw in the, uh, you know, the, the flat of fifth. Right, and then I also kind of discovered a lick as I was uh, kind of getting ready for this video. So doing half step bends, so, uh, Okay, the half step into the A, and then uh, I think that's what I did. So half step into the fifth, and then and then half step into the into the into the flat of fifth, and then I do a lot of these. So those are those eight note chromatic patterns, eleven note chromatic patterns. I have videos on that. So I, I, I talk about that a lot in some of my uh, other videos. Um, let's see, I'll do one more. Uh, let's see, I'll do one more modal pentatonic. How about, I'll, do, I'll do this one on D. So that's kind of interesting. So that's D, D Phrygian. So uh, you're on C sharp, D, uh, F sharp, G sharp, A. So that's going to be the Lydian. C sharp, D, 
F sharp, G sharp, A. And then A, G sharp, F sharp. Mm -hmm. So one of the devices I like to do here on this, I like to do half step uh, bend G sharp to A and then and, and that one there. All right, so that's, uh, and I also manual delay and, and a little uh, boss uh, compressor for that. Okay, so that's a lot of lot of information there. So um, so this will be a, a good start for for anybody who wants to get into you know learning to play in every single key, learning to play all the modes, learning you know seventh chords, you know one octave um, patterns, uh, you know the pedal tone thing, the modal pentatonics, uh, and and things like that. So I think what I'll do to to end today for my ending improvisation, I'll just put the track on and just kind of you know jam around. I'll let it loop like two times um, and then just kind of see what happens uh, with here. So once again, nothing, nothing planned here. So, uh, so have fun with this. Uh, this is a good uh, tool to start learning how to, you know, play in all the different keys. Uh, this is just a starting point and, um, um, you know, have, have fun uh, learning this. Okay. Uh, thanks for listening and watching. Uh, stay tuned for part two of 84 combinations, four bars per mode, 12 major keys, seven modes, Cage scale system guitar tutorial. Look, look forward to uh, the other parts.
Thank <laughs> you. 